Imagine that call to your insurance company and you say, uh, Flo, um, I I know I bought a $704,000 car uh, and I've had it now for like a couple of days and uh, I, I wrecked it. It's yeah, total. Not just any car. This yeah. car worth nearly three quarters of a million dollars. Uh-huh. And this happened where? Florida. Which is actually where you're from in Florida, uh, West Palm Beach area. This guy bought this $704,000 uh-huh. Ford GT sports car about a month ago. Of course, this man spending all this money, not familiar with how to shift it. Goes back to a trivia question we had recently oh, about geez. standard driving. Crash it into a palm tree, of which there's many in West yeah. Palm Beach. Yeah. Trying to go from first to second gear. Turns out it gets even better. Car not registered. Car not insured either. Oh. And the driver was only going 35 miles an hour at the time of the accident. But with sports cars like that, they're not built to run into anything. I've, I've never left the dealership without it being registered or insured. They take care of that for you. But if you have that kind of money, they go, <laughs> just write the check and go. They don't care. Right. It, it might have shown up in his yard on like a truck. They might have done the special delivery. He might, because how did he get it home if he's not good at driving it? Maybe it was just brought to him because he purchased it through a dealer. Happens. Listen, people with money can make weird stuff happen. You don't have money, so. It, it can, won't happen to me. Yeah, you can only yeah. be weird, not and, make weird stuff happen. And I tell you what. Almost as dangerous as their as their teeth is the gator's tail, it's and, and it's injured lady. Very strong. It's long and dense and very muscular. Sharp too. And that's isn't that what they use to swim? Don't they yeah, swish they, their tail? So it's like yeah. their super muscle. Right. But yeah, a gator attacked a woman with its tail in Texas. She was uh, out and about and wound up being transferred to the hospital with her injuries. It was on her front porch. Uh-huh. She just went out to go yeah. out her yard. Just yeah. Not like she was out walking on a path yeah. or something. Yeah. Went out and then, of course, wildlife officials had to come and remove it. Right. And now they're looking for its mate because they say it's mating season, which might explain why it was so aggressive. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So, so so watch out when you encounter gators. It's mating season and it could be so, extra dangerous. Yeah, it's extra testosterone and estrogen in the air. So yeah. it gives a whole new meaning to getting a little tail.